I'm not really a tattoo guy. The time I would have got tattoos probably would have been the 80s, early 90s. Imagine what would be on my body right now, Jesus. So many guys have really bad tattoos. Roadrunner, you know, the Tasmanian devil or barbed wire, yeah, stupid shit like that tattooed on them. <laughs> That's Conor McGregor. And he had no tattoos when he started. When Conor McGregor got that tattoo, I was horrified. And he said, you know, you know why you don't like these tattoos? Because you're too old. <laughs> oh yeah, I know that one. That's Brock Lesnar. So when you go to Brock Lesnar's gym, he's got medieval type stuff like horses and, and guys with the big metal helmets on and swords and yeah, that's an easy one. This has got to be, is that Brad Tavares? No, not Brad Tavares. I don't know. Oh, Holloway, God damn it, how did I miss that? A lot of these guys from the islands, man, I, th I actually think theirs are cool. They actually mean something. They're part of their culture and their history. Oh, Jesus, the da yes, this is, uh, oh my God. It's Darren Elkins, that's horrible too. Those are horrible, horrible tattoos. A tough dude, very tough guy. Get a t-shirt that says the damage in every color and wear it every day for a month or something, but come on. <laughs> A monkey? Is <laughs> that a monkey in there? Oh no, that's a deer. That's a, all right, never mind. That's a deer here, head with an antler. Well, the money logo is in there. Oh, maybe this is this Chad Mendez? Oh, TJ, I was close. I didn't even know TJ had a tattoo. That's gotta be fairly new. He's actually fighting here at Madison Square Garden against Cody Garbrandt for the title. Oh yeah, speak of the devil. That's Cody Garbrandt. You can't miss that one. Listen, when you start tattooing on your neck, you don't give a shit anymore, man. You don't, you don't care about anything when you're tattooing your neck. Good God. I see an owl. God, I don't even remember seeing this tattoo. Sugar Sean O'Malley. He's brand new. That's why I didn't notice that. But we're ready for him. We're excited. And that's one bad tattoo. It looks like a lion. Sleeping. He got me on that one. Oh yeah, Carlos Condit, all right. He's a really nice guy, really bad tattoo. Wow, that is horrible. That looks like something out of a Halloween movie. That is just bad. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Are nipples supposed to be eyes? 100% this guy thinks he's a vampire. Colin Fletcher? Yeah, I don't even know who that is. Diesel, Joe Riggs. The sleeve is pretty bad too. Listen, I'm waiting for a good tattoo. Show me a good tattoo. George St. Pierre, gonna challenge himself and go up to 185 pounds and take on Bisbing. And you know, Bisbing's had a lot to say and now it's become personal and those are always fun fights. Man, I'm better at this than I thought I was gonna be. Oh, I know who this is. This is uh, an Italian kid that used to uh, Legion was his nickname. I was just talking about this guy the other day too. Alessio Sakara. yes, Alessio Sakara. Isn't it crazy that, that, that you actually know these people by their tattoos? Oh, that's a really good bad one. I talk about his tattoo all the time. That is the worst thing I've ever seen. It actually doesn't even look like Johnny Cash. We get it, you like Johnny Cash, but to tattoo it on your body forever? They sell plenty of Johnny Cash t-shirts. Get one in every color. Alan Belcher, that is, that is one bad tattoo. He's super tough, he kicks like a fucking mule. Yeah, we were just talking about him, he was on the cover of Sports Illustrated. Roger Huerta, he was supposed to be the next big thing. That's why in the sport you never know, man. One minute somebody's unstoppable and then they can't win a fight. No, yeah, 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 yeah. I know this one because I always think it looks like the Pepsi logo. CM Punk. Wow. I don't know how you walk into a tattoo shop and say, yeah, I'll take that one right there. Boy, you got me on that one. I, I don't ever remember seeing that. Where the fuck is that? That's on his arm? <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah, I've never noticed that. I think tattoos are a bad idea whether you're a fighter or not, but man, fighters got some bad taste in tattoos.